hello folks good afternoon time check it's uh, 4 p.m. I just went to the open mall to buy something it's right here so our, our journey for today or our adventure just like finding our way home so we start the vlog here in the open mall shopping center because uh, like I said I need to buy something and um, yeah I didn't film of a bus bus ride coming here because my friend just passed by and she let me let me in so I went here free ride with my friend but now we're gonna find our way to central Arrecife and find the best bus stop that we can have so we can go home so come with me and enjoy this trip so by the way if you like this video please give a big thumbs up and subscribe come on let's go this is the parking lot it's supposed to be like a Mercadona before or Hipperdino I'm not quite sure but this is the whole place of the Mercadona or Hipperdino and this is the open mall actually the entrance is just right there we're walking in the back street at the back of uh, this establishment right here so let's go So I'm just walking in this uh, beautiful, uh, I don't know what you call it, a plaza or whatever you call it. It's really nice. As you can see, there's a lot of uh, white, white, uh, what they call this, um, white place that you can walk down, you know, instead of walking in a different part of the road. It's much easier for the people, you know, actually. But uh, to be honest with you folks, it's just so quiet out here. I don't know. It's just nobody around. There's a couple of people right there. A couple of people are sitting there as well, so yeah, this is my day, of course. We gotta find some way home. It's very quiet out here, folks. You see, there's a lot of buildings right here, so close right now. This is the center, this is the city, this is the uh, uh, capital of Lanzarote. As you can see right now, there's nobody around, it's just me and some folks are sitting there in the shade, you know, having the time of their life. There's a lot of stuff right here. Look, establishment here. It's not finished yet. I think it's gonna be a parking lot or something. And right here is the policia where you get all the residents and all the paperwork is right there. So we're heading to Marina. Just right there and see some boats. Let's see. Very small camera, so you can fit in. Sorry about the wind noise, folks, but I hope you can still hear me. This is what I'm talking about. You see, great wall. <laughs> so, we're just gonna walk around, like I said, and enjoying my best time of the life. You know, this is the city. Look, maybe two or three cars are just passing by, and some folks just walking there, and the other ones sitting in the shade. So, well, to be honest with you, the first time I walk here, just at the start of our vlogs, it's just I'm thinking about of, uh, something very weird, different in my head. And I'm trying to, to enjoy myself first. And the second one is thinking about the very, very negative things. But, uh, folks, it's very safe out here. It's just me. I don't know. <laughs> because they're looking at me. Maybe because I do have a camera in my hand. That's why they do like that. But to be honest with you, just very quiet and peaceful around here. I think that spot folks is just like when the water is high tide it's gonna fill up of water I think it's a uh, well some sightseeing when people are here sitting down enjoying you know their day off or just to roam around actually it's very windy folks I hope you can hear me well wow 
amazing folks this is a nice story it's a lighthouse I think it's original lighthouse that they put it here or it's a man-made I have no idea I think it's here before where all of this thing happened look very nice I see all the yacht right there look hmm the lighthouse lead us commemorative monument of the city of Arecibe in memory of awards of a man of the sea was promoted the birth of growth of this sailor tradition city the seven sailors who died in the cross on the sea terrorist attempt aiming to present all the sailors who one day sailed off from this port to never come back oh jeez that's very sad it's right here folks Set sail. I think that's the boat, the replica of the boat is here. But the original one is here. Oh, very nice. Good to see some history around here. Look at the beauty of this place, folks. You know, it's, it's a very beautiful place. The only downside of that part is it, it didn't work well. If you know what I mean, you know, they put uh, lots of uh, uh, investment in this place. But it doesn't uh, really work. You know, maybe the port is nice, you know, like the big ship can park there and every, every beat, oh sorry, every boat that uh, passing by can park there. Yeah, it's true, you know, because a big space and everybody Everybody's allowed to, you know, to park there. The downside with that is all the establishments are inside of the marina. Folks, it's a commercial center, but nobody around. If you know what I mean, you know, it's just like big shopping center with nothing on it, you know. There's some uh, places like uh, shoes, bags, and all the stuff that's selling there, but it didn't work well. Good to see some uh, bike lane around here. When they gonna allow this one? Uh, by the way, Wendy is fixed now, folks, so we can tour around in Puerto del Carmen around, or maybe play Honda or here in Arecibe with Wendy. But in few days' time, you know, try to fix some a uh, little bit more of uh, uh, tires and all the brakes and all the stuff. So I'm not quite sure, <laughs> but. He's, uh, he's, he's moving now. He's uh, what they call is fixed now. So, I'm gonna use it one day. <laughs> so windy, folks. I'm thinking about if I want to go inside the marina. I don't think so. There's no, nothing to see around. You know, you see some boats and all the stuff. So here's a map, like uh, Lugar de Interés de Iholico, <laughs> Geographic I think they call it. it. We're here at the number two, it's called um, Charco de San Ginés. This here, look, this part, the mini boats. I know. If you look out here, you will see all the mini boats that are floating around here quite amazing you know see this place is just like this very traditional and been well known for the very first year until now it never changed a bit there's a lot of restaurants here you know most of them are locals are living here and they have the best tapas and best food around most of the restaurants here are close at this part but I think in the evening it's much much way way better around here walking look at the view it's very awesome a 
got this part there yeah? wow and more and more restaurants are here imagine in the evening if you walk around here there's a lot of people having the uh, you know a few drinks tapas and all the stuff it's really nice just like you're walking in the Avenida Puerto del Carmen but instead of walking around cars and buses you walk along with the people and this beautiful view as well of course the church is just right there and the old cinema is right here I have no idea if they're open you know or it's still operating at this point I have no idea but that's all right there for a very long time and there's a lot of restaurants you see that's for their chairs I see it clearly around here I like it you know very very traditional and very very Hispanic place oh there's another restaurant right there upstairs Divina Italia there's a lot look you see up to the very end of this uh, Chaco de San Ines Wow, let's have a look around here. It's high tide, folks. Not gonna see at the bottom. But the view and the relaxation of Arrecife is just way, way better than Puerto del Carmen. You know, I think most of the people like a very quiet place and, you know, good place to hang out. Puerto del Gama is one of them, but it's very, very, very different, very busy. And there's a lot of uh, movement around there. Not like here, it's just like everything's very smooth and quiet. The best part of this is just like the cinema, the old cinema. I don't know if they're operating, I have no idea. You see that big whale? This is the bone of a uh, rock, rock twelve tropical, they call it, right here. And it's a big whale that is stranded in the Canary Islands and what they call this? Tenerife in 1995. It's nice. History is right there. It's not prehistoric, but it's a one giant baby whale that is stuck there. And, you know, bring it here. To preserve it's nice the view of uh, Chaco de San Ines and this is the other side we walk all the way there up to here just to see this place and this is the cinema that I'm talking about it's very big and you know it's nothing compared to uh, Dayland movie center I hope it's still it's still you know still active still playing and it's still working folks there's a lot of people there buying some tickets and don't watch the movie with the family it's nice I thought it's not working well it's working well you know we're now entering a central um, Calle Real I think yeah yeah it's called Calle Real If you're first time here in RCP, you might, might get lost. Yeah, because you can even see the beach. Not like in Puerto del Carmen. The, uh, the further you go in back street, the more higher you will, you go up. If you know what I mean, you know. If you went to TS, you will see Puerto del Carmen. Look, it's all streets right here, and even see the other part of the road because of all this big establishment that are here I was just gonna walk around it's close at the moment it's Sunday look how deserted around here I think the only open here is Hiperdino how about this spot see very quiet everything closed nothing but the good thing about you know the great trees that they plant in the middle 
uh, give some life in this place and a unique uh, structure as well uh, España well, they have some jamón in every culture or food of Spain is right here I'm not going there anymore you see even this part as well are renovating I hope they're renovated for good because this place is very dead it's 28 degrees here in the shade but outside it's 32 oh man <laughs> this is our way home folks I have no idea where we're going now this is the bad side of um, not having a plan it's just like I don't know where to go now and I have 20% of battery <laughs> look 28 degrees wow you know imagine a cruise ship just landed today and people are really really happy to go around but they come in this place everything's closed it's just like wow what happened here look let's have a closer look This is a museum, folks, in Arrecife. You can walk in every work days, but in the Saturday, Sunday is closed. Monday to Friday, they are open. I don't know who he it is. It's a captain or something. Uh, yeah, it's not our thing. So anyway, we ride, we walk on, end up here in the street for the camera oh even cars look nobody around and there's a tiny bit of a uh, fiesta going on around there look some mini stools maybe you can have some tapas around there or some uh, beer name it folks you can have it and we are here epic place yeah and that's the the castle I don't know what you how you call it let's find some uh, let's google it <laughs> I went there before it's a very nice spot folks right there it's a uh, I think it's um instead of a lighthouse it's like a tower to see enemies coming in I have no idea but I don't know the name I think it's just right here look oh, it's awesome we're doing this thing look right there number 13 I think that's the number 13 we're looking at what's the 13 name 13 13 13 there's no 13 on it <laughs> Charca de San Inés. We've been here before. Where is this? But there's no name. 13, right there. Castillo San Jose. It's right there. The very end, very top. Not gonna say it. Castillo San Jose. What? Well, here comes the bridge. Bridge as well. It's just right here in the front. So a little bit of history around here at Arrecife, which is uh, quite nice. They put some, uh, you know, unique place so people can jump around, walk around, enjoy, you know, the beautiful view and beautiful uh, tranquility around here in Arrecife. Even all the birds are very, very relaxed around here. See? There's a big, big space of water around here. If I have one of these in my house, Bella will be very, very active <laughs> and healthy at the same time. Like playground. Uh, it's for everyone. You see? Good, is, good to see it's very clean and tidy around here. It's nice. And there's a mini, mini spot around here. Look at this. 
Ouch, this is very careful walking out here. You know, supposed to have a water here, fountain and all the stuff. I think it's safe. It's safe to cross around. I think it's safe. Ooh. <laughs> Look, sober bridge right there. It's nice, I hope it works well, you know, some fountains and lights, you know. But uh, it's just like the. And there's a concert around here. Most of the concerts are doing here in RCF. Because Puerto del Carmen don't have much space. Puerto del Carmen have a space in the front of, um, what do you call this? Rio Paraíso in Los Posillos. A big space around there. They can have some concert around. But here, I don't know. Here, they put more and more concert around. One great adventure by Vince Page, right? By the way, folks, I'm just... I'm just walking in the main road. I'm not, I didn't walk in inside the Recife. You're not going to see a thing. That's why I walk here. You see some bit of the of the park, some bit of uh, open space, ocean especially, beach. It's very very different around here. You see, when we walk in the Calle Real, the most commercial spot, it's just like very quiet out there. There's nobody around. Things are way way different around there. Not like where they're coming. It's very very different. Of the the Gobierno de Canarias, this all the paperwork happen, you know. They're gonna pass all the residents, all the passport and things like that. <laughs> it's right there inside. <laughs> I'm tired now, folks. <laughs> I don't know how long we were walking now. I came here at CP at one, and what time is it? It's uh, almost 5 in the afternoon. I've been here 5 hours now. I think we're walking for 2 hours straight now. I have no idea. You know, I've been lost in some places that I didn't vlog. <laughs> I didn't put it in the video. I went in a, in a road that... Uh, no way we can go in. And then I went back for another 20 minutes. Ah, jeez. That's why I walk here in the main road. It's much easier. Just go straight, 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 straight. Ah, lots of things are fixing around here. Look, this screen is still here. It's been there for six months now, I think. Actually, no, over a year now. I remember when we were buying a ticket to go to the Philippines, they starting the the crane is just right there, but not tall as that one. You know, it's very tall. Look, but there's some, you know, change around it. Look at this. There's a big stage around here. I thought there's a concert going on, but it's in that building right there, the brown one. <laughs> they, they do some practicing of live bands around there, so it's quite nice. I thought there's a big concert, so I said, wow, it's nice. Well, I think they do. Let's have a closer look. It's very windy around here. Oh no. It's very windy, folks. I'm walking at the main road right now because I don't know if they're open there or not in the back of that uh, I think it's open I'm uh, just walking here it's much easier uh, you know concert right here look yeah I think there's a big concert here Oh, good thing they're finished now right here this uh this mini road you know way back that we went here is just they fixing the roads and taking all the 
taking all the roads and fixing it. But now it's already fixed, so it's nice. Look. It's a nice spot. Great concert right here. It's a big, big concert. It's nice. Good to see people are here and enjoying the sunshine as well. This is another view of the beach. Be honest with you, this is uh, most, 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 this most beautiful than for the coming. But well, what they do around it, they open it for the people and no cars are just running around in this spot. It's nice, cool, yeah? They give this place for the people so they can walk around, they can bike around, they can enjoy. Even you have a kids, you're not gonna get wrong around here. I think business here is gonna be awesome because they change it. Look, supposed to be cars around here, but now folks, nothing. You can put a big terrace around here. Mini, mini, mini bar, and you're good to go. Look, it's way, way better. But the problem now, if you have a car and you're living here, that's the problem. This is similar as like um, where we went, ah, in Boracay, Philippines, similar as like this. All the hotels are in the side and the beautiful beach is in the front. That's most of the part. It's nice over here. There's a big party around here. There's a lot of uh, mini stuff like this one. You know? Enjoyable beverages all over the place. And of course, you know, the most authentic uh, restaurant and bars around this place is still open for the people. It's great and I really love what they do in this uh, in this shade look you can sit down here and watch the whole beach sitting in this uh, beautiful bench that they do it's for around 10 people and you have a beautiful beautiful shade and the beautiful beach of Arecife pretty much alive around here I think if you're staying in one of these hotels, it's just very awesome. You got the beautiful view and nicest place to hang out. See folks, the stage is right there. The hotel is just right there. And this uh, nice uh, beach that will full out to people when the concert starts. It's really nice. You know, like I said, in the um, Los Posillos, that's the biggest place that you can, you know, you can, they can put some concert right there and people will love it for sure. Because, you know, you don't need to pay some spots. Just like one big spot for each of everyone to enjoy. We reached now the very end of this uh, beach. We call Reducto, Playa Reducto, I think. I'm not quite sure, but uh, I'm gonna look for it. I'm gonna look for it, so I can put it right there if I'm right or wrong and we reach our destination as well this is the last well this is the first bus stop of Narisife if you're coming here from Puerto del Carmen so this is what I walk in from we start at the very end of this spot so folks if you like this video please give a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel thank you very much for coming with me and watching the videos I know it's a very boring thing, you know, but uh, I hope you like this one. If you do, please subscribe and share it, love it, put a like on. And yeah, thank you for watching, folks. See you the next one. Bye bye. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm tired. I'm very tired.
I'm not lying, this is a long, long way walk that we do. And like I said, I went in a different spot. I end up in the very end. There's no way I can go, so I need to go back. I didn't film it. Stupid. I didn't film it, so you can see it. But uh, yeah, this is my day, folks. And thank you. Thank you for watching. And see you the next one. We made it here. This is the place where all the buses coming in. And you will get one at the port of the coming. So yeah. Thank you for watching. And bye bye. That's three times now. I'm gonna make it four. Bye bye. <laughs>